The science has been proven many times throughout the years. Washing your hands can prevent you from getting sick, especially during flu season. A study even estimated that if everyone washed their hands regularly, we could save a million lives each year. But don't get too excited because another study found that only 5% of people wash their hands long enough to kill germs after going to the bathroom. That's pretty gross. If you don't wash your hands when they're dirty, those germs on your hands can spread. Most likely, you'd pass them on to your friends and family and potentially get them sick. You could even infect people you don't know if you spread those germs to commonly touched objects such as a doorknob. But let's say you don't care about other people. You can get sick too. Your hands can carry germs into your eyes, nose, and mouth and cause some serious illnesses. That's why the CDC recommends washing your hands often to help keep you and your family safe. It's recommended to wash your hands for at least 20 seconds, making sure you get soap under your fingernails, in between your fingers, and on your thumbs. But what about hand sanitizer? We know how quick and convenient it is. When you're on the go and don't have a place to stop and wash your hands, or if you don't have access to soap and running water, Hand sanitizer can come in, well, handy. But how does it compare to washing your hands? And what if you were only to use hand sanitizer from now on? Well, let's start with how soap actually works. Essentially, when you place soap on your hands, it kills the germs and traps the dirt, forcing it to wash away with the running water. Hand sanitizers, on the other hand, usually contain an alcohol base. Yes, the same alcohol that gives you a good time on the weekends. And when used on your skin, it can kill germs and prevent them from spreading, helping you avoid getting sick. And studies show that if soap and water are not available, using hand sanitizer can be an effective alternative. But the key word there is alternative. Although the alcohol and hand sanitizer can be powerful, it doesn't work for all types of germs. And if your hands are visibly dirty or greasy, hand sanitizers won't work so well. Instead, they'll sort of spread the dirt around. This is why washing your hands with soap and water should always be your number one choice. But what if you use hand sanitizer every time? Like we said, hand sanitizers are good alternatives to soap and water. So if you were to use it every day, you would would still be protecting yourself from germs. But if it was all you were using, you would start to have some problems. Like we said before, hand sanitizers don't kill all types of germs, meaning there would be some germs that lurk around, so you can still get sick. At the same time, sometimes hand sanitizers are too good at killing bacteria. If you used it every day, you'd probably end up killing some bacteria that are actually beneficial to you, and this may disrupt your microbiome as a whole. And while hand sanitizers are good at killing bacteria, unlike soap and water, Water, they don't actually remove the bacteria from your hands, so your hands would still be dirty. In a nutshell, hand sanitizers can be pretty useful when you need a quick way to disinfect your hands. This is also why you'll see hand sanitizers in a lot of hospitals or dental offices. That being said, it should always be thought of as an alternative to soap and water. Thank you for watching, and if you liked the video, make sure you hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss our new tips every week.